she comes out. I see the door open, but I don't see her. <laughs> oh gosh, what? Wait, what? What? Where is she? Now that was just spooky. Hey everyone, it's me, Belladonna, and I'm here with another part of The Sims 4 City Living, part 13. Yay! I'm really, really excited for this part. Honestly, because I think something big is going to happen in this part. Like, I just feel it in my bones, you know? And I know what you're thinking. Where are we, Bella? Where are we, Crystal? Like, where are we? This is not the city living house. This isn't even the vacation home that we were in. Like, what is going on? Well, I will tell you what is going on. I did switch households for just one second. Uh, I switched over to Salem. We left the vacation spot uh, while they were at vacation. Uh, Amber and Salem became official and it broke Toby's heart even more. He's very, very sad. Last time I left the house, he was crying under his bed, under his bed sheets or whatever. Like it was really, really sad, but it happened. It happened. And if you missed the last part, I will, you, you have to watch it. Like you have to watch it. Cause it was so, it was such a mess. Oh my gosh. It was just a mess. Oh my gosh. But basically in a nutshell, Amber woohooed with Salem while she was with Toby. She did it all while she was with Toby. Like, like she just didn't care. You know, it just, it just happened. And Salem was the one who propositioned her. Propositioned, is that how you say it? I hope that's how you say it. Uh, but yeah, that's what, that's what happened. And it was so crazy. It was so insane. But it happened. No, no matter how crazy or insane it was, it happened. And Salem is actually, like, in love with this girl. He is in love with Amber. Like, he is just... How can I explain it? Like, when he was, you know, fooling around with Gianna, he didn't feel what he feels with Amber that he felt with Gianna. Which is why he thinks he's in love with her. In love with her, my bad. Uh, but... It's really not the case. It's just, he's just really smitten by her, but he's only a young adult, you know. He's still really young. Amber is probably a little bit younger than him. And he's not really sure if he's really in love with her as much as he believes he is. So, even though, you know, he's kind of going through some stuff in his head, we on the other side of the, of the computer can't really tell Salem you know, what is real and what is not. But he thinks this is real. He thinks this is love. And when you are in love and you think this is the right thing to do, you marry the person that you are in love with. So, you guessed it. You guessed it. Salem wants to propose to Amber. He wants to marry Amber. Even though they haven't even been together for like a day. Literally only been together for maybe 12 hours, if that. <laughs> it has not been that long at all. But Salem wants to propose to Amber. So that's what we're going to be doing in this part. We are going to go over... By the way, his apartment is a lot messier than I imagined. This is actually the first time I've been in his apartment. I don't remember it being this messy. It is horrible. Ugh. I mean, this is just not cute. <laughs> this is not cute. Oh my gosh. But anyway, <laughs> let's go over here to our household over here. And we're going to visit apartment or actually just invite to hang out. Amber. And we are going to try and have Salem propose to Amber. So let's see if she comes out. I see the door open, but I don't see her. <laughs> oh gosh, what? Wait, what? What? Where is she? Now that was just spooky. That was spooky. I did not see her coming through that door. <laughs> she did some, uh... 
I dream a genie kind of magic on me just a minute ago. Like, girl, you just flew by me. You just flew by me. But anyway, this is Amber. She's here. He's going to do it. So let's try and get, you know, the romance up a little bit. Gonna have him, you know, ask a risque question. Compliment her appearance. Uh, let's see. Cur 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 s cheek. However you pronounce that. I am not a pronunciation queen. I just, I just don't have it in me. But I'm trying to do better. I mean, if you, like, see my videos and, you know, like, I jumble my words up a lot. Like, if I'm doing better in this video with my words, let me know. Because I, I, I tr I'm trying to get better. I'm trying to get better. Where, what are y'all doing? Oh. Y'all are walking away. I thought y'all about to woo-woo <laughs> again. I'm like, don't do it. Don't do it. Not right now. Uh, don't chat with her. Be romantic with her. Seriously. He is such a lazy bomb, though. Like, what if Amber actually accepts? This is the place that she's going to be living in. This is, this is not cute. <laughs> Ugh. Ugh. And like he's so talented. He's really good at the writing skill, but he's so lazy that he just doesn't really do anything about it. He's he's pro what's the word procrastinating? So it's just really awkward because he won't do anything about his talent. It's like kind of a waste of talent in a way. But Amber really does like this guy, but we're gonna see if she really loves him in a minute. We don't know. Okay, so let's try and speed it up a little bit because I'm ready. Okay. Okay, so they're in a, a Morris exchange. So let's try and propose. Let's see. First of all, let me get some lighting in here. I know you guys, but I need a thumbnail. I need a thumbnail. Thumbnail props. Thumbnail props. That's what I have. That is what I have. Um, Let's see. The best lightning for me is like the three little cylinder things like... Over here, these are the best lights for me. Like, I don't know. I am I use them in every room, whether they match or not. But they're just such good lights that I just can't help it. <laughs> like, look how bright that made the room, you know? Like, everyone should use these lights. I'm just saying. Just saying. Just saying, but I am almost... Why does he have a hookah thingy thing in his apartment? Like... Out of all the things you could have in this apartment, Salem, you would have a hooker thing? Like, are you... He is insane. This is not a good guy. He is trash. Salem is trash. Like, this guy is trash, and he's about to propose to my Mickey Mouse-loving Amber Vora. Even though I don't know what she is anymore. Like, she woohooed with Toby. I mean, not with Toby. She woohooed with Salem while she was with Toby. That's what I meant to say. That's what I meant to say. Of course. But let's see what happens. I'm so nervous. I am so nervous. Oh, gosh. Here we go. Where are you going? <sighs> okay, okay. I mean, you can do that at the window or not. Wait. That is not how you propose. Are you going to propose like that? What? No. No propose to her i was about to say like you just don't ask you're supposed to get on one knee uh i have to do it okay here it is this is just so annoying <laughs> so annoying okay take two <laughs> um okay it's about to happen i hear the music Sorry, music, but <laughs> I gotta get a perfect shot for this. I got to. Okay. Ugh, that plumb off, though. Oh my gosh! Did that just happen? <laughs> Did that just happen? She accepted. Is she insane? Do you not see the place that he's living in? Wow, Amber. Wow. I guess she really is in love with this kid. 
or man, whatever he wants to be, whatever he wants to be, I can't, I can't, I cannot believe that they're engaged. So now that, uh, the walls are canceled as usual, but now that, uh, Amber is engaged to Salem, and, oh my gosh, he has mouses. Ooh, I feel for you, Amber. This is just, ooh, no, no. But she accepted. Apparently, she does not care about his messy apartment. She really is in love with Salem. I guess she feels the same way that Salem feels about her. They're just kind of crazy, stupid, and young love. And now he's at the bubble bubbler. Bubble, what is this called? I forgot what this is called, honestly. Bubble blower? I think that's what it's called. Horrible. This is what, sh this is her future. This is her future. But since Amber, <laughs> since Amber is pretty much, you know, engaged, she's probably going to move here. Which means Toby and Gianna are going to be without a roommate. So I guess we're just going to have to find a new roommate. But that will be probably after the, no, they probably need a roommate like right now. Right now. Oh my gosh, she's playing Sims. Oh my gosh, that's Sims 2. Soleil. That's Sims 2. That is so Sims 2. What a throwback. What a throwback. But anyway. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's a fire. There's a fire. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm done. Anyway, we are going to go back into Amber's household. And I will see you all when I get there. Um, you guys. Gianna's pregnant! Oh my gosh! We never even took a pregnancy test. Oh. My. Gosh. Gianna is pregnant. She's pregnant. She's pregnant. Okay. Um, I didn't expect that. Amber, are you pregnant? Oh, no. Because <laughs> they both had a woohoo. Oh, please say no. I can't handle the both. Yes. Okay, Amber is not pregnant. She's not pregnant, but Gianna is. Oh, no. This is huge because Gianna isn't really the mom type. She's kind of the wild party type kind of girl, and now she's about to have a child. I don't know what to do. <laughs> I didn't expect that. Oh my gosh. And it's Jared's kid. Oh no. That is horrible. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. I have no clue. I guess Gianna's probably moving out, too. <laughs> this is just... What? Uh, I'm gonna have her go over here and ask the chat with Jared to tell him that they're expecting. <laughs> wow, this is a shocker part. If you don't watch... Okay, you guys, if you don't watch any other of my city living parts, you gotta watch this one. And probably the next one, too, because all of it is just really crazy. Is this, this is insane. That MC commanded, though. Like, seriously. So we're gonna, <laughs> we're gonna share the big news that she's pregnant. Oh, that is crazy. I'll have her go to work. She has a wedding to plan soon. Uh, we'll probably do that in the next part. Um, Amber is pregnant, you guys. Amber is, not Amber, but Gianna. I knew what I said. I knew what I said. I said what I knew. Oh, gosh. Gianna's pregnant. I mean, I love the toddlers, though. I love the toddlers, but I don't know how they're gonna do this. I'm thinking Gianna will probably move out as well. 
and she'll probably live here with Jared, and I'll probably kick out the others and put them somewhere else. So that's probably what's gonna happen when she has the baby. So Toby is gonna actually have to find two new roommates. <laughs> oh, or maybe just one, who knows? I don't know, I don't know. But I didn't expect this at all. But Gianna's gonna be a mom. Amber's getting married, and Toby is at work being really sad that he lost his girlfriend. Like, <sighs> he's just so sad, and he's at work. Um, let's see, is he close to promotion? He is. So let's try and have him work hard. They really do like each other. So, since they like each other so much, let's just have them become official, I suppose. Let's see if we can do that. I to be boyfriend. Because she does like Jared. She really does. And now that she's having this baby, she, she might as well, you know? So, they're together now, which is cute. <laughs> um, let's see. Is he working hard? No, I want him to work hard. And I told you to go to work. Oh, no. It's not, it hasn't started yet. So, my bad. My bad. <laughs> um, but anyway, I think that is all for this part. That is all for this part. So, next part, we're probably going to... Uh, I don't think so. I don't think so. But anyway... I'm going to end this part right here. Like, comment, and subscribe. If you have any baby names, don't forget to leave them in the description below. Because Gianna's about to have a baby. I don't know if it's going to be a boy or it's going to be a girl. I didn't I didn't plan this at all. Like, I didn't at all. Oh, goodness. Out of all the kids that I have, why Gianna got to have a baby, though? Why Gianna? She's not going to be a very good mom. I hope you know that. <laughs> She's not going to be a very good mom. But, um... I'm probably going to switch households around, play with Amber for a little bit, then play with Toby for a little bit, then play with Gianna for a little bit within each part. So my city living LP is going to be changing a little bit, but I'm excited. I'm excited. Even though I didn't expect this from Gianna, I am excited. So yeah, but yeah, don't forget to leave some baby names below and I will see you all next time. Love you guys so, 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 so much. Bye guys. under his bed under his bed sheets or whatever like it was really really sad but it happened it happened and if you missed the last part I will you you have to watch it like you have to watch it because it was so it was such a mess oh my gosh it was just a mess oh my gosh but basically in a nutshell Amber woohooed with Salem while she was with Toby she did it all while she was with Toby like like she just didn't care you know it just it just happened and Salem was the one who propositioned her proposition is that how you say it I hope that's how you say it uh but yeah that's what that's what happened and it was so crazy it was so insane but it happened no, no matter how crazy or insane it was, it happened. And Salem is actually, like, in love with this girl. He is in love with Amber. Like, he is just... How can I explain it? Like, when he was, you know, fooling around with Gianna, he didn't feel what he feels with Amber that he felt with Gianna. She comes out. I see the door open, but I don't see her. Oh gosh, what? Wait, what? What? Where is she? Now that was just spooky. Hey everyone, it's me, Belladonna, and I'm here with another part of The Sims 4 City Living Part 13. Yay! I'm really, really excited for this part. Honestly, because I think 
something big is going to happen in this part. Like, I just feel it in my bones, you know? And I know what you're thinking. Where are we, Bella? Where are we, Crystal? Like, where are we? This is not the city living house. This isn't even the vacation home that we were in. Like, what is going on? Well, I will tell you what is going on. I did switch households for just one second. Uh, I switched over to Salem. We left the vacation spot uh, while they were at vacation. Uh, Amber and Salem became official, and it broke Toby's heart even more. He's very, very sad. Last time I left the house, he was crying to Amber. So that's what we're going to be doing in this part. We are going to go over. By the way, his apartment is a lot messier than I imagined. This is actually the first time I've been in his apartment. I don't remember it being this messy. It is horrible. Ugh. I mean, this is just not cute. <laughs> This is not cute. Oh my gosh. But anyway, <laughs> let's go over here to our household over here. And we're going to visit apartment or actually just invite to hang out Amber. And we are going to try and have Salem propose to Amber. So let's see if she comes out. I see the door open, but I don't see her. Oh gosh, what? Wait, what? What? Where is she? Now that was just spooky. That was spooky. I did not see her coming through that door. <laughs> she did some, uh, I dream a genie kind of magic on me just a minute ago. Like, girl, you just flew by me. You just flew by me. But anyway, this is Amber. She's here. He's going to do it. So let's try and get you know, the romance up a little bit. Gonna have him, you know, ask a risque question, compliment her appearance. Uh, let's see, caress, caress, cheek. However you pronounce that, I am not a pronunciation queen. I just, I just don't have it in me. But I'm trying to do better. I mean, if you, like, see my videos, you know, like, I jumble my words up a lot. Like, if I'm doing better in this video with my words, let me know. Cause I, I, I try, I'm trying to get better. I'm trying to get better. Where, what are y'all doing? Oh, y'all are walking away. I thought y'all about to woo <laughs> again. I'm like, don't do it. Don't do it. Not right now. Uh, don't chat with her. Be romantic with her. Seriously. He is such a lazy bomb though. Like what if Amber actually accepts? This is the place that she's going to be living in. This, this is not cute. <laughs> Ugh. Ugh. And like he's so talented, which is why he thinks he's in love with her. In love with her, my bad. Uh, but it's really not the case. It's just he's just really smitten by her. But he's only a young adult, you know. He's still really young. Amber is probably a little bit younger than him, and he's not really sure if he's really in love with her as much as he believes he is. So even though you know, he's kind of going through some stuff in his head. We, on the other side of the of the computer, can't really tell Salem, you know, what is real and what is not. But he thinks this is real. He thinks this is love. And when you are in love and you think this is the right thing to do, you marry the person that you are in love with. So, you guessed it. You guessed it. Salem! wants to propose to Amber. He wants to marry Amber. Even though they haven't even been together for like a day. Literally only been together for maybe 12 hours, if that. <laughs> it has not been that long at all. But Salem wants to propose 